Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will learn another new filtering operator that is nothing but skip operator. What is this skip operator? Let's open this skip operator. If you open this documentation, so the skip operator, if we, if we see the description here, returns an observable that skips the first count items emitted by the source observable. That means whatever the count you will be mentioning, those many values, it will be skipped and the value after the count it will be it will be emitted now here the syntax is skip and it takes the parameter of count it, it is of type number the count the number of times the items emitted by the source observable should be skip the reverse of take operator so what i can say is the skip operator is nothing but the reverse of the take off take operator if we take this take off count means those many values will be displayed and then after it will be skipped but the skip operator means so first values what are the values it, it is taken it will be skipped and then afterwards it will be displayed now here if uh, the return type is an observable as you already know and if you see the marble diagram here this is the source observable and it is displaying a b c d e these are the values that is emitted by the source observable if you add an operator of skip operator skip of three this is the count value and the first three values will be skipped and then after the two values will be emitted by the output observable emitted to the output observable if you see the output here skip of three means a b c is skipped and d e is the only output we are able to see in the output observable and a, and immediately it will be completed skip the values until the sent notifications are equal or less than the provided skip count it raises an error if skip count is equal or more than the actual so here you need to understand that it raises an error if skip count is more is equal or more than the actual number of emits and source raises an error okay you need to understand this one so it raises an error so if the skip count is more if the skip count is more than the actual a source observable the value say emitted by the source observable is equal or more means then it raises an error let's try to see it in the practical implementation so this is all about this skip documentation let's try to implement this one if i go into here and i will create the component for the skip operator yeah so let's implement here and for the time being what we will try to do is in the operators.html i will try to add it here so skip and i can use something like skip here and if we go into this one app routing module let me implement this wrap routing module also and here i am adding like this and that one will be skip and let it create it is still creating i think yeah it is created and here i can use skip operator component that's it now let's go to the component here skip operator and if i open this ts file now here if i if i write so for example if we go here and if i refresh the page and let's go to the skip operator so this is a skip operator now i want to same thing i will add an interval so for every 500 milliseconds it will emit the value dot subscribe of data sorry this will display console dot log of data now i want to add a skip operator here i want to skip so 10 values after 10 it should be displayed if i do subscribe like this and if i do skip yeah so now it will be displayed from 10 11 12 like this 0 to 9 it will be skip from 10 onwards it will display so let's try to see the output if i try to see the output now here if we try to see it will wait for some time why because so 0 to 9 it is going on displaying after 10 c you are able to see the data it is being displayed here so that is the nothing but the skip operator so skip is waiting until the values from 0 to 9 it is skipping and then after when the 10 value is emitted it is going and emitting the so to the output observable so this is about the skip operator now for example this interval i want to take only 20 values okay so i can add a combination of operators here so i want to take the first 20 values out of these 20 values i want to skip the first 10 values so that means 10 to 20 only it has to display so let's try to see the output how it will display so here it will try to display 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 and it stops see 
now if you try to go to the complete here so we'll try to implement the error also so that we will see the error scenario so i am displaying the error and here in the complete so i am displaying console.log complete okay so this is the complete so if you try to see the output if i try to refresh it again if you see the output what will be the output let's try to see in the skip operator it will wait for some time so it need to take out of interval it need to take only 20 values so here it, and in those 20 values we are skipping off the 10 first 10 values so here it is calling from 10 to 19 and complete it is calling the complete and also you need to remember the order of the operators for how you are applying is also very important for example here if i add skip operator front and add and i add the take operator at the end means then the output will be different now the output how it will be let's try to see so here it refreshed and here it will wait for 0 to 10 okay and it will go on display the data so 10 11 14 17 18 19 20 so after 20 also it is displaying so why, why is this one is coming so after 29 29 it, it came and complete why it is what what it is happening is first the skip operator is applying so it is skipping from 0 to 9 then afterwards from 10 onwards it is it is emptying the data to the output observable but it will take the operator 20 so that means from 10 to 29 it will take the values so 10 to 29 is the 20 values right so it will take that one. so this is the scenario so first whatever the uh, order of the operators is the main important for example see i have taken so i want to take only the 20 variable 20 values okay but i want to skip 30 so i want to skip 30 out of this one so then what will happen let's try to see so i am refreshing this one so let's let's see what will happen here so now it is it is uh, still taking the data so let's see what will happen here so it is not at all emptying the data here so it immediately told it is complete so it is not it, it hasn't emitted any data it immediately told that it is a complete so so it is not raising any error but it, what it is displaying it is displaying it as a complete so if you try to see here it is trying to take the 20 values but we are skipping the 30 values right so 20 values only but it has to skip the 30 values so what will happen let's try to see it is it is just simply it is just simply telling it as complete why because it is it has skipped the 20 values but it has to skip the 30 values right but the observable is emitting only the 20 values only for example if you see here i will try to write of 1 comma 2 comma 3 okay so we are having an off so this will emit the values of 1 comma 2 comma 3 in a so these all will be displayed so now i want to skip 30 so there are no, there are no 30 values to be skipped here there are only three values only it will be skipped for example if i add two here only the two values will be skipped only one three will come output so if you try to refresh this one let's try to see what is the output it will come so three has been came and complete now i want to skip oh, i want to skip five values but there are no five values here only three values are there let's try to see if there is an error comes so it is simply saying it is a complete so that means here what they are telling that if traces an error if skip count is equal or more than the actual number of emits and source raises an error so they are telling that it raises an error they are saying that but here it is not raising any error it is simply calling the complete okay so this is that is the thing we need to understand so they told that it, is, it will be raise an error but it is raise, not raising any error so we are skipping off i it is more than the actual number of values what it is emitting but it is not raising an error so this is all about the skip operator so simply what i can say is the the skip operator will skip the values the skip the first values the whatever the count you have given the skip the skip skips the first n number of values that the count has given and later on it will display all the values so if the skip count is more than the emitted values in the source observable means it just calls the completes it will not raise an error according to me so what we have seen the code so if any wrong means please let me know in the comments we will see okay this is all about the skip operator if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you